The Story of Hanukkah A long time ago, in the country of Israel, there stood a beautiful temple in the city of Jerusalem. In Jerusalem lived an evil king named Antiochus, the king of Syria. He didn't like people who had beliefs different than his own. He went around the world, fighting against people so that he could make them follow his beliefs. King Antiochus decided to fight the people of Israel. His army won, and he told everyone that now that he was in charge, only his gods could be worshipped. He told the Jewish people of Israel that they must give up their own beliefs and follow his beliefs. If they didn't, they would be punished harshly. Another of his orders was to destroy the Jewish temples, including the beautiful one in Jerusalem. Most of the people decided they had no other choice but to follow Antiochus' commands. But one man, Judah Maccabee, decided the king was wrong. Something had to be done. Judah and his brothers, who were great soldiers, formed an army to fight the king and his army. Judah's army, known as the Maccabees, were much smaller than the king's army, but the brothers fought with all their might because they were fighting for what they believed in. The Maccabees won, and the king was defeated. They went to reclaim the temple in Jerusalem, but it was in a terrible state. As they worked to try and repair the temple, they found a small container of oil, enough to keep the menorah burning for only a short time. But a miracle happened. The lamps burned for eight days and eight nights, and the Maccabees knew God was with them. Every year at Hanukkah, Jews light eight candles in the menorah.